What's going on, everybody? Today, we're going to be going over how to play better lockdown defense in Madden 22. If you're new to the channel, please drop a like on the video and hit that red subscribe button. We do have a giveaway up to $50 on the first of the month. Every month, I'm going to be giving back to my supporters. Without further ado, let's get into the breakdown. What's up, everybody? If you want to take your Madden 22 game into the next level, the link in the description has my ebooks, and every ebook that you get gets a free upgrade for four months. I repeat, free upgrades for four months. Let's get it. All right, so the first defense we're going to be breaking down is my cover four shell. Okay, so we're going against Trips tight end with a motion. So, like I said, where the trip side is, I like to put an inside third. That solo receiver, let's look at that again. I like to put him on either an inside quarter so he can play some route on the field, or I would put him into an outside third. Otherwise, he would just sit there if nobody's in his zone. So, we're going to go back and look at that. I am running cover four quarters right now. I have a full match game plan and a zone drop game plan on my Patreon and in the ebook. So he motions somebody. So we got our defense all set up. I am using that safety on that right side. So you can see he's looking for a deep bomb from the left side to the right side. And that's the reason why I put an inside quarter on that play. Now, here we go again, 14-7 ball game. He's in a trips look on the wide side of the field. So the first time he did a motion. So like I did, I back my defender up on that side in case it's a corner route. They play corner routes better if they don't have a bunch of flood routes in that area. So as you can see, I am watching the middle. He goes to a corner route and you can see how good that guy played it. So let's go back and look at that again. So we coming out and cover four quarters again. All I'm gonna do with my user is run around in the middle of the field. So I'm right here underneath two routes just to take more time for routes to develop down the field. And as you can see, we were able to break the pass up. It should have been an interception, but we're gonna look at that one more time. You can see the adjustments on the field. I'm blitzing one of my linebackers. I have everybody close in the box and then I backed off that cornerback on that right side so he could have low balled it to that slant underneath but he was already looking for the corner route on that play so good defensive adjustment all right so you can see my audibles cover six invert cover six i have a full match game plan so first and 10 right here up 14 to 7 my opponent is running the ball i'm always blitzing one of my linebackers either i'm using him or i'm gonna let him come into the gap in case they run the ball. And as you've seen right there, he comes in right away and blows the run up. So let's look at that again. So I blitz either my user or one of the inside linebackers and there he is with the gap shoot, getting the running back in the backfield for a three yard loss. So he can see that he can't run the ball. So he has to put the ball in the air. So here we go on the second and third team, making my adjustments inside third, that trip side and then on the back side you have to take away what your opponent is trying to do on this play i'm going to be a little more aggressive i'm going to chase the quarterback out of the box and make him throw it prematurely and we have the back side shell with perfect adjustments in the perfect position to get a user yank them let's look at that one more time so i'm mixing in my cover four quarter scheme with my cover six invert you can see i have that inside third on that safety i run like i'm user in that underneath route he could have threw it to him but he wanted the deeper route down the field perfect adjustments that you need you can either user rush the quarterback to make sure he has to check down every single time or you can do like i just did and bluff it i guarded the underneath rope for a little bit of time make him put his eyes further down the field and then i go after the quarterback he's either going to hit that check down which is only a two or three yard gain or he's going to try to force the ball down the field and we're going to be successful with an interception 
So I am making my adjustments, option defense on conservative. I'm on auto base align right now. If it's a small formation, default. If it's a bigger formation, trips, tray, gun bunch, I do auto base align. So we're gonna look at my adjustments on this play. So I got my entire team pinched. I got that inside third with that safety. He runs out of the box right here and that deep rope, I'm back there to help guard it. Everything else was matched beautifully. So let's look at this breakdown one more time. Cover six invert is the play that I am choosing. So I'm taking that guy, cross man to him on one of the threats across the left side of the field. First and 10, I am taking that safety I brung down, cross man to him. I'm blitzing my slot cornerback and I'm gonna play underneath and then run down the field. Everything is matched accordingly. If you wanna know how to do any type of match principles that you see in this video, go get the ebook or become a Patreon member and get the full match seminar. Everybody that has the ebook, an uh, update is coming to y'all either later on today or first thing in the morning. Thank y'all for all the support. If you enjoyed the video, drop a like and let's get it.